What you just heard, saw, and felt is part of Jill Jarman's resonance for solo cello. The patterns on screen are far more than just art. They are the scientifically produced cymatic images of each note I played. The science of cymatics began in 1967 when Hans Jenny first used an oscillator to show how the vibrations of musical pitches formed unique patterns in sand on a metal plate. The images I used, I generated on a 434 millimeter plate, and each note has its own physical characteristics. Music can seem immaterial, ephemeral, and sometimes we dismiss things that are merely seen, heard, or felt, but they have substance. You've seen the music. It's as real as the chair you're sitting on, as real as the heart beating in your chest. What if intangible objects are as real and impactful as things we treat with certainty? We do things we can't touch, but that touch others. Have you ever felt someone looking at you? Or considered the power of words? Music makes waves in the air. We've seen them make patterns in the sand. We've felt them resonate through us. And we do the same. Our thoughts and actions form the patterns of our lives of who we are, even if we can't always see or hold them. There are lots of things we can't see. Take your hands and put them together in front of your face. And look straight ahead. Now, begin to lift them. And after just a few inches, they seem to disappear. Now, it doesn't mean they're gone, and I'm sure you have no doubt they are still there and are very real. When we're that certain, the sounds we make, whether words or music, and what we think, feel, and do are real and as impactful as the physical objects around us, like the instruments we use 
Then we gain a whole new perspective on what's possible and we can affect meaningful change in the world. <laughs> you might think you know what's going to happen. You have seen me before in this very space, but nothing stays the same. Maybe there's more. How can we be certain when everything changes, even us? Before, you saw the physical patterns of the notes in the first movement of Jill Jarman's Resonance. And in this extract from her second movement, the music evolved. It was not the same. Using a formula by Melendez to relate sound and light, every note in this extract had more than size and shape. Each note had a specific color. And what we see, hear, and feel, our whole experience was different. That one change mattered. The waves of music, just like everything we think and do, they're real, and they have substance, like that heart beating in your chest. And their impact, your impact, whether big or small, is real, and it does make a difference. Thank you. <laughs>